Hi, it's Pastor Mark here from BH1 Elim Church in Bournemouth. I want to talk to you just for a couple of minutes about faith. Now, I'm an Elim minister and as an Elim minister, we accept, we recognise that our wages or our stipend as a minister is, is the last thing in the month to be paid. So basically, if there is uh, the, the church pays all of their bills, they pay everything else that's needed to be paid. And then the minister's salary is the last thing in the month to be paid. So if, if there is no money in the church, then the first thing that isn't paid is the minister's salary. And that might seem a little bit harsh to some people, but actually what that gives us is a remarkable opportunity to really say that we are living by faith. Hebrews 11 tells us that faith is the substance of things hoped for. It is the evidence of things that are not seen. When we live by faith, we don't put our trust in ourselves. We don't put our trust in the things around us. We don't put our trust in our bank accounts. We don't put our trust in uh, our, our cars. We don't put our trust in our, in our property. We put our trust in God. We don't even put our trust in other people. Our trust first and foremost, is in God. And the Bible tells us that he will supply all of our needs according to his glorious riches. That is the confidence that we can have in God, knowing that he will provide everything we need. Jesus himself, didn't he, in, in the Sermon on the Mount, said, do not worry. He said, don't worry about what you will eat, what you will drink, what you will wear, any of those things, because the, the pagans, the, the ungodly, they run after those things. He said, the Father will supply all of our needs. He says if, if he uh, provides the needs for the, for the birds, how much more is he going to provide for our needs? Now, I recognize at this time, as we're going through our lockdown period, that many, many people might be worried. They might be worried about the everyday things of life. They might be worried about the material things. But I want to encourage you today to put your trust, to put your faith in God, not to put your faith in anything uh, on, on the earthly plane, so to speak, or in the earthly realm. Our trust is in God and is in God alone because he alone can provide for us. And sometimes I think God really just uh, allows us to go through things so that we can learn to put our trust, to put our faith in him. I'm not saying that God causes difficulties to happen, but God will use those difficulties when they do happen for his glory and for our benefit. The Bible also tells us as he uses all things for the good of those who are called according to his purpose. Everything that happens to you, good or bad, God will use it for your benefit when you have faith in him. So I want to encourage you today, just uh, in this very short video, that when you're struggling to lift up your eyes and not look at the things around you, not look at our normal areas of provision, but to look at God and trust and know that he will supply all of your needs. God bless you.